All right, uh, hello guys. Welcome back to another video with my uh, just amazing background. I know, it's literally just like the wall in my bedroom. I really need like a, some sort of curtain that I can just like pull down and then boom. But we don't have that, so we're gonna work with what we got. Anyways, as you can see by the title, um, I found an old camera in my bedroom and we're going to explore it a little bit see how it works uh and i figured you guys might want to uh watch it too you know see what's see what's going on so yeah uh let's let's get into it so yeah all right so um as you can see here's the camera um i don't here's the thing <laughs> I'm not exactly a photographer or really know that much about like point and shoot cameras like this. I mean, I, I love technology and you know, I know a lot about phone cameras, but not, I don't know too much about like uh, a camera like this. So yeah, anyway, so let's remove the cover first. Okay, let's not break it. Um, I will try and tell you some specs best I can. Uh, so we have, what kind of, what, I think this is a, what megapixel count? 8 megapixels. <laughs> Marketed as 8 effective megapixels. Um, so it's not the biggest lens, but, you know, it's fine. Now this camera is kind of just, it's all sort of like one, um, piece. So you can't really separate this part. Like, you can unscrew this to put some different lenses on it, maybe some different focal length lenses. Um, but that's as far as you can like disassemble it. You can't really like uh, disassemble it further than that. So we're gonna leave this screwed on here. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's <laughs> let's leave this screwed on just so we don't uh, mess anything up. So let's let's take a little look around the camera. So first off, we have a little um, a little little spinny thing. So you can rotate it this way if you're filming yourself and you want to like. Uh, see yourself or you can have it like this if you want to have a bigger screen of what you're seeing or you can just have it not there at all and then look through the little uh, piece right there so yeah um let's see what we have a few buttons here we have a delete button a, I don't actually know what that button is I'm not gonna know what half of these are <laughs> um, menu button quick button this is to scroll through photos, I would assume. That's select things. This is the zoom slider. So you can zoom in a little bit by pressing that. Uh, go back out by pressing that one. This button right here switches between this view and this view. If we look at the top here, we do have a spot for like a microphone mount or light or whatever. Little tiny screen. A little, uh, was this little slidable thingy? So you can, you can record both video and photos on here. Not sure how great it is, but you can. <laughs> uh, then we have like a little on and off switch where you switch it to turn on and off and then the little camera button itself, obviously, you know, you gotta have that. Um, this little button right here turns on a backlight for the display. This one, I'm not sure what that one does. Not sure what either of these do either. Um, we have like a little, what would you call that? It's like a little, uh, well, you can, you can like take a little strap and like wrap it around both sides or whatever. And yeah, so that's there. This, I, th I believe this is like to focus because it slides. Probably shouldn't slide it because it's going to be really out of focus. Um, but yeah. And I think that's about it. Uh, so you put the battery in here, which I actually do have the battery. No, no, that's the wrong one. Uh, you put the battery here. Yeah. Um, so I do have a battery charging, so I will pull that out in just a minute. And then, oh yeah, so right here's where you would put in your storage. Um, so I don't actually, let's see, I think I have one right here. So it comes, it came with this little, uh, bag thingy. Um, yeah, okay. So I have a one gigabyte, <laughs> um, sand disk, which, you know, that's a few photos, but you're really not going to record video with one gigabyte. Um, came in a little case here, but so, I mean, it's, who knows how old this thing is. It, it probably is kind of old. Uh, but yeah, so it's a Ultra HD, <laughs> um, one gigabyte, SanDisk, compact flash, you know, it's a little storage card. 
So what you do is, uh, you notice the little like holes right here. So you are going to stick them in the in the camera in here because I don't know if you can see it very well, but yeah, there's little pins in the bottom in there. So I believe it goes in like this. So we're just gonna take it, make those little holes go down into it, and we're just gonna push it in like that till we hear a click. And then, yeah, so if you want to eject it. There's like this little thing you right here. So you push it down once and then push it again and that ejects it to where you can pull it out. Uh, so we're just gonna leave it in there for now. Close the lid and now you got your storage in there. Um, I guess next let's turn on, turn on the camera. So we're gonna have to get our little uh, battery for that. So I'm gonna cut this next little bit while I'm getting the battery off the charger and then Pretty sure I'm gonna have to like set up this camera because I didn't do this beforehand. So I'm gonna cut this stuff out. Uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay, and real quick, so I got the battery. I just kind of want to show y'all how um, it goes in. So you turn the camera upside down and then there's this little flap here. So it will be locked, but you just want to slide it over and then this little flap will open up, stick it in there. Um, if you look on the battery, it has little uh, pins right here they'll line up with the pins on the inside. I don't know how y'all can see that, but it'll line up with the pins on the inside. So just make sure you line that up properly. It's got a little spring to it. You're gonna flip that closed, and now your battery's in. So then let's uh, flip it on. Okay, so we have a little bit of battery life in here. Um, so you'll notice too, when you turn the camera on and off, yeah, it'll automatically like do, it'll just, I guess, get the lens ready to film, uh, take pictures and videos and stuff. That's kind of interesting. I wonder why it's not doing it again. Let's see. I don't know. Uh, but y'all, y'all can see the backlight. If you press that button, it'll turn the backlight on and off. Yeah. Um, I do not, okay, yeah. So let me set up. So you'll look, let's rotate this here. How are we gonna rotate like that? So let me set up the camera real quick and then I'll get back to y'all. So yeah, I'll be right back. All right, we're back guys. So now as you can see, when you turn it on, it will automatically pull out this little thing. So we can see just on this, again, it's not uh, the best of quality. Um, not At least definitely not on this little tiny screen here. Um, I wonder how well I can show you guys the inside of it here. Okay, I do not think it's going, yeah, okay, no running. So that's kind of what the view you would get uh, if you look through this. So it's on. So let's let's go to the big screen for now, just so I can like show y'all. So to zoom in and out, so you'll press right here to zoom out. And then you'll see it will extend the, um, the lens, yeah. <laughs> then press the other side to zoom back in. So that's as zoomed in as it goes. Uh, you have your flash right here, so I guess let's try taking a photo. So you can see through here. Now this battery is not perfectly charged. I bet what well, let's do, so it actually does come with a spare. So let's um, chuck this spare one on the charger while we're using this one. So if this one does die, we will have another one. Uh, so it shouldn't be too big of a deal. So let's just throw that in there like that. And then yeah. Anyways. Um, so let's see, so okay, you can see there's not a ton of battery left, but you know, we'll, we'll continue and see how that goes. But anyways, um, let's take a picture of something. So it's obviously not going to be perfect. I do not have um, a computer that I can get the picture off of this from. I wish I did. Uh, so that'd definitely be something we need to work on in the future. Um, but you know, it's fine. We'll, we'll get it figured out. It's fine. Um, anyway, so let's, let's say we get like, cause I mean, this screen is not very pixel dense, so it's not going to be amazing, but you know, let's, let's, uh, let's get a picture of mm, this. So we'll just use like a little, uh, standard Apple, uh, charging brick here, 10 Watts. Actually, I think this is, yeah, 12 Watts. Okay. So. I do kind of wonder, so like, it's definitely not a huge sensor. Um, so, I don't know how I'm gonna be able to show you all this. 
Um, it's definitely not a huge sensor, so it's not going to be super easy to like to get very much. Like you can't get too much natural blur out of this because it's not a huge sensor. You can't just you know yeah. So let's get a let's snap a picture here. I did not mean to zoom in that far. Um, so let's say we just, let's take one. So I got the brick here and we'll take a quick little picture. Uh, press the button. So it actually automatically did the little flash. So we took a little picture there. So let's put this brick away. Um, so why don't we, let's, so you can see it's actively updating here. See, there's my hand. Yeah. So why don't we go to the camera file and yeah, okay. So I don't know how well y'all can see that, but there is, it, it took a little picture. Now it's not perfect. I mean, you can tell there's not very much background blur at all, uh, which I mean, I kind of expected. I mean, it's not an amazing screen right here to view it on. I bet it probably, it definitely would look a little better though if we had it on like a, like, uh, you know, you imported it to a, um, computer, but that's, I don't, I can't really do that. So we're going to work with what we got. <laughs> um, but anyway, so it's there. So I don't actually know what I have on this, uh, photo album here. So I just have some random, uh, video or photos here, but so you can kind of scroll through them using the arrow buttons here. So to go forward, you press the forward button. It's a picture of my dog, <laughs> um, and and just stuff like that. So it's pretty cool. Um, uh, let's see, what other like modes do we have here? So we have the green is the photo. I do not know what P S A M mean at all. Um, so yeah, but oh, there's me. You can like kind of see me in the window in the reflection. That's kind of funny. All right. Scene. I don't know what that means. There, you, so you can record video. I don't know how great it is. And I know this does come with a built-in microphone. So let's let's record something here. So let's start. Uh, okay. So it's recording. Uh, as you can see, it says recording right there, and it's actively it's actively recording. So let's just record a, a thing or two. Just kind of move the camera around. And then we'll click the button again just in the recording. Um, so it just saved. So next what we'll do is go to the photos, just like that. And then here's the video. Uh, let's see, I do not know how to turn the volume up. I don't know if that's a, I don't see a switch for it anywhere. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. So let's, we'll be quiet here and just see how this sounds. But yeah. All right, let's go. If it will, oh, gotta click that button to start. Uh, okay, so it's recording. Uh, as you can see, it says recording right there and it's actively, it's actively recording. So let's just. All right, I'm not gonna make y'all sit through this whole thing, but as you can tell, the microphone, absolutely awful. Uh, you do not want to film with this microphone. And I believe the microphone, yeah, it's like right, that, uh, I think it's right there. Um, I don't see anywhere else it really would be. Could be the speaker too, I don't really know. But, you know, it's fine. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it probably would be better camera quality if it was like on, if, it, if we imported it to a computer, but, you know, it's fine. Um... Let's see, I know there's not like too much else in this little container here. Um, I know when I got it, it came with a few things. It came with a little charger. Um, we do actually have another, okay, I'm trying not to knock this over, okay. So we do actually have like another lens. Let's sit that over to the side. Uh, we have another lens. I, let's see. So it, it protects your lens from scratches or fingerprints. Uh, and it removes or absorbs ultraviolet, ultraviolet <laughs> rays, uh, gives sharper contrast to your film or videotape. So, um, I guess it's like, it's for outdoors. Now, I, this lens has been messed up. Uh, as you can tell, it, 
it, it's a little hard to tell, but yeah, like in that reflection right there, it's it's a little messed up. I don't know why it's like that. Uh, but I guess, because if we compare it, I just about knocked that over. If we compare it to this one, so let's unscrew this one here. Um, let's see. There we go. So if we un if we compare it, so this is what was on the camera. This is this one. So you can see it's definitely a little darker. See, uh, if we put this one here, you see this is how it kind of looks through that. This is how it kind of looks through this one. It's ever so slightly more tinted. Um, yeah, so interesting. Uh, there's not too much here. But yeah, so it's just a little, I guess it's for, you know, taking things in the sun. Keep your photos from getting like, because I bet it's, I bet it's probably for glare because yeah, I just, I got a feeling that's probably what it's for. It's probably for glare uh, to keep like the glare and stuff away. Uh, but yeah, so let's put him back in there just like that. Um, yeah, well, I'm probably boring y'all to death, <laughs> but I think that's really about it for this. Um, yeah, so let me, let me cut to the outro. I'll be right back. All right, well, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please remember to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Um, I'm trying to post a little more content. It definitely gets kind of hard at times because I'm doing other things, but, you know, we're, we're, we're trying to get it done. So, I appreciate y'all for watching, uh, this far, if you've made it this far. <laughs> I know I'm a little boring, but, you know, it's fine. Anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see y'all in the next one. So, yeah. Bye, guys.